Hey everybody, it's Cora. So today I thought I would give you guys a tour of a finished travel journal. Um, I say finished, but there's like two or three pages back here, but that's just because I, I like ran out of... I had two or three pages left at the end of a trip and I knew another trip wouldn't fit on two or three pages. <laughs> so this is my finished travel journal insert for my traveler's notebook. So I started this one in November of last year and I just finished it at the at the, the very first of this month actually. I always like to put little bits and doodads in the front. This started out as kind of just like a regular journal, like day-to-day -day journal. Something that I tend to do is um, even though I'm not going on bigger trips, I like to put fun days and stuff in my travel journals just to kind of help fill it up a little bit and to document the fun days like out, even if it's just to the nearby city, you know. Uh, so that's kind of what I do here. This is the day we went ice skating. This is when I went to see a violent night with my brother. That was pretty fun. Um, and then here is the start of one of my first tri actual trips of the year. I went to Orlando in January to Universal. Uh, we saw Puss in Boots in the theater there on City Walk. I always like to keep uh, this little thing that they give you at the... the I always usually... We usually always stay at like Dockside. Um, and the Endless Summer Resort in general. It's a lot of fun. I always keep my key card and just it's a nice little souvenir this one I didn't really journal a ton for this trip but I did like to keep a bunch of like bits and doodads of uh, things I bought wrappers of stuff this ice cream was so good I got the Earl Grey and Lavender and it was the most delicious ice cream I think I've ever had it was very good this was my plane ticket home so pretty much that's all the journaling I did that trip, which is unusual for me. Uh, but it was it's still like a cool collection of things that I did. I got my ears pierced um, at Claire's, unfortunately. I know I'm not supposed to do that, but it was very impulsive, and I knew if I didn't do it impulsively, I would never get my ears pierced. So <laughs> this was a bowling day we did as a family. This was another trip to, um, we live close to Chattanooga, so this was another trip to Chattanooga. This was Connooga, which is like a comic book anime convention thing. That was fun, we did that. This was just like a day me and my brother went out and got some ice cream and hung out. I found this map of Chattanooga, which I had never seen before actually, so I kept that because it was cute. Um, and that was this day for Chattanooga. We kind of went for my birthday there. Like, before my big trip for my birthday, me, my mom, and my aunt, we went up to Chattanooga and hung out and went to the market and stuff, and that was a lot of fun. And then starts my Boston trip, which I did do a more in-depth flip-through of my Boston section of this journal in another video. So if you want, like, a more... I might go through that a little fast, but so if you want a more detailed flip-through of this part, uh, feel free to go watch my other video. This was a lot of fun. It was my first time further north than the Smoky Mountains in Tennessee. <laughs> um, I kept the... Well, this isn't the original map of the tea. I, like, copied it so I could keep my actual map in my map box. But, um... I... This was a lot of fun because I got to save up and take my mom on a trip. Even though it was for my birthday, I, I was really happy I got to do that for my mom. Also, I'm sorry if you can hear my dog snoring in the background. He's a very loud snorer. <laughs> but, yeah. So, this was a lot of fun. Uh, saved up. It was my mom's first time flying. I, I like flying a lot, so I'm glad I got to experience that with my mom. And I'm glad I got to take her somewhere, because she, she doesn't get to go do a lot very much, and I, I like... I like getting to go hang out and do stuff with her. Boston was a lot of fun. Um, it's a place I've always wanted to go since I was like pretty young. I was really obsessed with the American Revolution, um, Paul Revere specifically, so it was really cool to see like his grave. I still have to write here. I Sometimes I, <laughs> I 
I'm like, I'll come back and write in this in a little bit once I gather my thoughts a little better, and then I forget. <laughs> I like to keep... I thought about cutting these up and kind of scrapbooking the maps and stuff in, but I, I really hated to... I really enjoy National Park Service brochures, so I figured I'll just tape it in as like an extra page, so that's what I did. Um, and this is part of a postcard that I cut out. I always have to do a photo booth kind of thing. Uh, everywhere I go, if there's one, I have to do a photo booth thing. Uh, it was my mom's first ferry ride. We went for four days, two full days, and two half days. Uh, but yeah, it was a lot of fun. This was another, just a little trip out to Chattanooga. And then this is the most recent trip I went on to Gatlinburg. Fun fact, actually, the Smoky Mountains is the most visited national park out of all the national parks. Not Yellowstone, not Yosemite, uh, the Smoky Mountains, which is interesting because I, I didn't know that until like a year or two ago. But yeah, we, this is a place that I used to go with my grandparents every year. Um, my family and I, we all go as often as we can. It's, it's kind of one of my happy places, for sure. It's it's always so... I really like the way the mountains are up there, and this time when we went, it was kind of rainy, so it was that much more pretty. I took my camcorder with me, and I do have a vlog of that on uh, the channel also. But uh, we did see a bear. I was very happy, even though we didn't go out to Cade's Cove, which is where bears... you're, you're for sure going to see a bear usually. Um, because it, 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 it was a little further out, so we didn't get to go there. But... We did do Roaring Fork Motor Nature Trail, which was a lot of fun, and that's where we saw the bear, and we had, none of us had ever been on that before, surprisingly, and it was really pretty, and it was really gorgeous in the rain especially, but yeah, we went to Parrot Mountain, it's a place with a bunch of birds, you can feed them, hang out with them, talk to them, Treasure Quest Mini Golf, because I am a slut for anything that has any resemblance to Indiana Jones or, uh, Uncharted. Then we went to the island, they had a photo booth, but it was dark, and for some reason they didn't have a flash inside there. So these are dark, but it's okay. It, it gives a character. And yeah, that is a pretty quick th flip through of my finished travelers journal insert, notebook insert. Um, I do have a few more if you guys want to see some more of these from like previous trips and stuff. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!